Hi Aries, this is Dreamseer 444 here to do your weekly forecast. So Aries, it looks like this week you're going to be focused. Okay, you're about getting things done this week because you have the Ace of Pentacle and the Ace of Wands. I see you being focused on creating a new um, foundation for yourself, something that's solid, stable, um, and I feel that you are locked into whatever um, idea, whatever the plan is, Aries, I see you being focused. You have a strong desire to, um, to get this new beginning. Um, so there, there could be a huge financial opportunity that comes in or some um, divinely guided creative idea that is going to put you in a very um, solid and stable spot. Okay, but it's about beginnings. This is you working towards your future and your beginnings and your focus. Now, what I see coming in is you elevating something. Um, there is a two of cups and there's also the king of wands. And Aries, this could, very, could be very well you, fire sign here, um, going into a very strong union and elevating and taking it to the next level. Um, whether this is marriage relationship or um you taking a a union could be business opportunity as well with the king of wands a very strong union and and elevating and moving forward with it now this could be some type of business opportunity that creates a lot of um wealth for you aries Others of you, this is about a um, a connection because the Queen of Wands shows up right after the King of Wands. But let's talk about the things that you need to avoid because the Queen of Wands shows up over, over here on this side. And what's going on is, I feel that for some of you Aries, you're going to need to release something um, in order to get to this elevation, Okay. I feel there's the Queen of Wands, there's the the Knight of Wands, Page of Pentacles, Justice, and the Knight of Cups. There is an, a smaller offer that's going to come in for some of you Aries, and um, it could be very, you know, it could seem like very similar to something that's already coming in for you, but it's a Knight. There's a King here and there's a Knight here. In order for you to get this um, total fulfillment right here with this king of wands queen of wands i think it's very um i think it's important that you um stay focused on your goal because you have a look at the bigger picture here the bigger picture is you want this ace of pentacle ace of wands and even though you could very well obtain that with the knight because you have two knights here um you are at a level uh, where you are sitting as, as a king and a queen, okay? You are already at a certain level. So you don't, you may be thinking um, of, you know, turning down an offer that is going to be smaller than what you, you know you deserve here. Um, I feel that this could be, if it's dealing with a relationship, I feel that someone's going to come in with an offer, um, possibly offering up an apology and wanting to bring balance to a connection. But I think Aries, um, someone will be looking at the bigger picture that this offer is just not enough um, because they are destined to be in something that's more solid, more stable, and more divinely, um, divinely put together. Okay, so this is what I'm getting here for you, Aries. There may be a decision to be made this week because I see um, three people, King of Wands, Queen of Wands, and... I'm sorry. Yeah. King of Wands, Queen of Wands, Knight of Wands, Knight of Cups. Someone wants to come in with an offer, but it's just not a big enough offer. I feel, Aries, that um, you may want to avoid taking lesser than what you deserve. That's what this mess, that's what the, this lesson is about. Okay. So, Aries, this is what I have for you this week. If it resonates, you guys come back and like and share and comment. You're more than welcome to on my channel. Um, I thank you so much for your support and I'll see you on the next one.